I started looking at alternatives, and one of them was uh, the brainwave technologies, the different technologies out there to stimulate the brain. And it was very controversial at the time. You know, everyone said this was a placebo, a high-tech placebo. There was nothing to it. It couldn't possibly work. It's way outside the model. There really isn't anything here. It's too far beyond where we are scientifically right now. We proceeded to have a brain map done at that point. Uh, found out that he was diagnosed with ADD. We've been doing the brain training and it has been fabulous for him. And went over step by step what's going on in my mind. And he was about 100% correct. Everything he mentioned was exactly what I was feeling and what I was going through. He said he did neurofeedback training and it had to do with getting the brain waves to respond to different things and um, I found that very intriguing. People are looking for ways to improve their, their brain. We, we do some process here called brain brightening. People can and be more lucid as they get older. And it's the same thing with neurofeedback. It's like, it teaches you that when you let go and just let it happen, that your brain works in a way that it, it lets your body react the way it's supposed to. It's, it's, it's a way to train what's one of the most important things in the game, and that's how do you train your brain to get ready to hit the next pitch? After a few sessions, I said, I think I can be better than I was even before I got in that accident. All of a sudden, the light had changed, and uh, uh, my energy had quieted and kind of uh, leveled out, and I felt better than I had in years just doing one session. So I knew there was something going on here. This stuff is really powerful.